Welcome back to Project Alex and this is vlog number 3. Ito yung part 2 nung top overhaul video natin and in this video, we'll be showing you guys the things that you do when performing a top overhaul. Yung tatanggal ka ng valve lock, valve retainers, valve springs, uh, yung washers, tapos mag-perform ka lang valve lapping, also known as polish fitting, and in Tagalog, ang tawag namin doon, asinta. And then, reassembling the cylinder head before mating it back to the engine block. But before all of those, please show us some love by liking this video and subscribing to our channel. So ayan, sumulan na natin yung disassemble tong cylinder head. And for this job, ang ginagamit ko is 1 fourth drive, saka yung 1 half drive na mga socket wrenches para ma-disassemble ko tong cylinder head. So una, tatanggalin muna natin tong intake manifold. Uh, it's cut in place by this. 12 mm bolt so magamit tayo ng 12 mm na socket actually ginagawa ko luwagan ko muna lahat so ayan tanggal na yung bolts kailangan na natin tanggalin yung intake manifold So, before natin ma-access yung springs, kailangan muna natin tanggalin itong rocker arms, mga rocker arms. And to remove these rocker arms, kailangan natin ng 12mm socket para matanggal ito. So now natanggal na natin yung rocker arms. So para naman matanggal yung spring, kailangan natin ng spring compressor. So you could buy these at your local automotive shop or pang wala, meron din sa Lazada. I forgot how much I bought this pero ayun, nabili ko lang yan somewhere. A few inches later. So yan, natanggal na natin yung valve springs. Ngayon, pwede na natin tanggalin yung valves and then tatanggalin na rin natin yung valve seals. So ngayon, tatanggalin natin yung valve seal gamit ang pliers. So, i-compare natin yung mga lumang seals, lumang valve seals rather, sa bagong valve seal. Yan, ito yung mga luma. 
Tapos itatabi natin yung bago. You see the difference? Mas maluwag na to. So ito, this will create a tight seal sa valve para hindi lulusot yung oil. Compared sa luma, brittle na siya. Bago hindi. Nasi-squeeze-squeeze mo pa. Tapos bumabalik siya sa original na form. Ito, hindi na matigas na to. So, ito yung mga kailangan natin na uh, equipment or tools sa pag valve lock. Kailangan natin ng valve dalawang malinis na cloth or in this case, dalawang dalawang tissue tapos valve lapping tool pero ako, I prefer using yung high pressure hoses tapos grinding compound saka ayan, pa ako, panglagay ng grinding compound sa sa valve face okay, so ayan sumulan na natin so yun, before we start, kailangan din pala natin ng oil para imimix natin dito yung grinding compound so, lagay muna tayong oil Kunti lang, huwag masyadong mabuhin. Tapos, hindi natin ang grinding compound. And tapos, mix nyo lang. So, ipapakita sa atin ni Rafi kung paano mag, mag polish fit ng valve. So, una, anong unang gagawin ito? Siyempre, lalagyan natin itong winding compound dito sa meriang ito ng valve. Ano ang tawag dyan bro? Valve? Valve face? Valve face. Oo, uh -oh, ayun ang na. valve face. May tama ka. May tama ka. <laughs> Tapos, kakabit mo yung high pressure hose sa kabilang dulo. Para ka na naglalaro dito. <laughs> Kasi ang taiputin mo hanggang sa kuminis. Ayun o. Pansinin nyo yung tunog. Sa umpisa, rough yung tunog. Kasi magaspang pa. Pero once kumikinis na siya gamit yung grinding compound, Mag-smooth out yung tunog niya. Yan o, oh, ma'am. Smooth na yung tunog. So, ulitin lang ng ulitin hanggang mawala na yung graph na sa tunog. hindi pa na nababalb lap or nababalish pero pag napakinis mo na siya ganito na isura dapat na ito na ba? o oh, ayan para kita nyo yung difference ito yung luma tapos pag nababalb lap na ito na or pag na-polish fit na or na-asinta na yun yung tawag ng iba asinta so yan this is the before ito yung after so ayan yun yung ginawa ni Rafi yes ang ganda diba Always remember na huwag lalagyan ng grinding compound itong valve stem, itong area na to. Kasi pag nalagyan yan at nag-valve lapping tayo, magagasgas yan, napasok yung oil dyan, di ba? So, ayun nga, kaya meron tayong dalawang clean na cloth or in this case, yung tissue kasi yung isang cloth, 
pang punas ng grinding compound sa valve face tapos yung isa pang linis naman ng malinis na area para siguradong walang grinding compound na papasok sa valve guide and that was the second part of our top overhaul series meaning magkakaroon pa ng third part okay di ba uh, oh by the way after valve lapping don't forget to clean the cylinder head and all the components thoroughly kailangan kasi walang dumi yon before the assembly ng cylinder head okay and speaking of reassembling the cylinder head, sa third part ng series natin, doon namin ipapakita on how to reassemble the cylinder head, how to install it back to the engine block, and paano i-install yung timing belt and how to time it. Kasi kailangan lahat ng rotating parts ng engine nakatime or nakatiming. Kasi pag hindi, may masisira doon. Alright? So, ayun. So, guys, thank you for watching and please don't forget to like and subscribe. See you next time!